lovely humans, how are you doing? Welcome back to my channel. So, I am so excited because I am gonna be watching Bee and Puppycat, the brand new series that just dropped on Netflix. Well, not brand new because it's been on YouTube and I binged the whole thing. So I am super excited um, to see this Netflix version of it. I can't wait guys, because I loved the original and I'm gonna say, I watched the trailer for this and I'm kind of obsessed with the aesthetic. Like, I feel like it's right up my alley and I know this is like kind of a surprise but yes, that is the next cartoon that I'm gonna be reacting to. Now, I understand that I didn't finish Dead End Paranormal Park yet, but I will be finishing it. I only have two more episodes left, so I have decided that I'm going to combine those into one finale reaction video, which will be up very soon this week. But I wanted to react to this right away because it just came out, and I kind of can't contain my excitement. That's the other reason. So yeah, I hope you guys are excited. I'm excited. I'm so excited to start a brand new cartoon adventure. And um, yeah, I don't know. I try to like dress a little bit like similar to the aesthetic. I feel like it's a lot of pastel colors, a lot of cuteness. You guys like my teddy bears? <laughs> I was feeling very creative today, guys, in terms of my makeup. So yes, anyways. I'm so excited to watch it! Eee! I hope you guys are excited with me. And for anyone who might be new to this channel, hi, my name is Kelly. My channel is called Kelly True Thoughts. I like to watch cartoons, especially cute ones, and talk about them. And I also like to show you guys cute stuff and try to send you positive energies and positive vibes. That's what I'm all about, happy, cute energies. So welcome if you're new. And if you're not new, welcome back. Um, for my cute kawaii item of the day, I thought this would be the perfect chance to show you guys. I can't believe I didn't show you guys this yet. The cutest purse in the world! Okay, so I got this for Moony Life. As you guys know, I'm obsessed with that store. I've talked about it so many times before on my channel. But this is the cutest purse in the whole world. Now, I saw this there and I was like, I don't know what this is. I guess it's a little bunny girl. It looks like she's kind of dressed as a bunny. I don't know. But as soon as I saw it, I was like, I need this. And the strap is really cute. It has like little bunny girls running on it. And I don't really feel like you could fit a lot in here. Um, it's kind of like the perfect size for a cell phone, but it's super, super adorable. Eee! I actually, did I show you guys this already? Like I have so much stuff at this point that I'm like, I feel like I show you cute stuff and then I'm like, wait, did I already show that in another video? Well, if I did, it doesn't matter. I'm showing you again because I love this purse and I feel like it kind of like matched my vibe today. So I love it, I love it. All right, let's start the episode, can't wait. All right, lovely humans, I cannot wait to watch this. I am just so excited about all of the adorableness that's gonna happen. So this episode is called Again for the First Time, which is a very interesting name. So far we have some nice relaxing piano music, very relaxing. Oh, look at all these nice little, oh, the artwork is interesting. Definitely looks a little different than the YouTube. Oh, House of Cats, okay. Guess we're starting with that. What are they doing? They're kind of creepy cats a little bit. Phones are plugged in all the way. Aw, look at all the little kitties. They're cute. Oof. Oh, Bee, you look so cute in your cat outfit. By the way, guys, I did react to a few episodes of Bee and Puppy Cat on my channel, but I haven't reacted to every single one. So I will link those at the end of the video if you guys want to check out the episodes that I did do reactions for. Oh no, something's on fire. It's the boy she has a crush on. Oh no. Is he burning the kitchen down? Oh, he's baking. Trying to bake. He's like, help. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> How is that gonna help anything be just by booping him with a frying pan? Boop. <laughs> Why did that cat give him a high five? That does not look good. Put out that fire. <laughs> So, wait, do they have like a cat cafe? Is that what this is? They look, the art style looks different for sure. Like maybe more cartoony, I guess? Yeah, it looks way more cartoony. Kind of looks like a manga, sort of. I read a lot of manga growing up, guys, so I know what I'm talking about. B, I don't know, that does not look good. Employee of the month. Well, that's his sister, right? I love their cat outfits. I want that. I want the same. I want a cat apron. 
Wait, what happened? Why do they look so sad? They all look so sad. What happened? Uh. <laughs> that old man is so sad. Okay. <laughs> what a scary young old woman. Who is that old man? Is it like just raining on them? What's happening? Aw. <laughs> He's only baking because the old guy wanted him to. Try a new energy drink today, guys. I said I was gonna try to look for healthier ones. This one is Fit Aid. It's good for sports recovery and it's an energy drink and it's mango sorbet flavor. It's really good. I worked out before this so I was like, okay. Might as well get all my vitamins back. Oh, It's just like raining on them and they're just like, whatever. Oh, so she, he's working for her. <laughs> the cats get too attached to everybody. That's a, that's a cute place that they work at. I wanna work there. Oh, jeez, there are glass in your boots, girl. T How does that not hurt? Mayor Grandma. <laughs> oh, her name is Mayor Grandma the cat. <laughs> yeah, that's so funny. Cats always do weird stuff like that. Goodbye forever. B, you have the cutest umbrella. Oh, B, you are fired. I would scream, but I don't want any more mouth wrinkles. Eek. Well, that's why you shouldn't have called her old B. What the? What'd you expect would happen? Make jokes about somebody and calling them old. You don't think they're gonna get angry? Come on, girl. Oh, poor B. That's a tough spot to be in. Oh. Was it just because she made the old person joke? <laughs> poor B. Okay, that girl almost jumped in poop. I'm glad she jumped over it. I did not want to see that. <laughs> did not want to witness that. <laughs> Why is he walking backwards? Like, watch out for the poop. Okay, good, he didn't step in it. <laughs> that cat just knows what it wants to do and just does it. <laughs> That's what all cats do, isn't it? <laughs> Okay. Um, okay, so that's Puppy Cat. Shh. She says, I wish I had a cat. But then she said no. So is that why Puppy Cat is half cat, half dog? Because <laughs> she like almost said cat, but not really. <laughs> oh no. Oh, why is, why is Puppy Cat just flopping around like that? so cute. I love the animation of this so much. It really does feel like I'm kind of like watching a manga, but it's like such a beautiful color aesthetic. This is how she found Puppy Cat. So cute. I love this. We get an origin story. Look at the stars hanging from her ceiling. Bea, I love your style. I want to move into your apartment and be Romy's. Seriously. Jeez, how did you even do that? How did you even do that with your umbrella? <laughs> like, ouch! <laughs> oh, oh, is he gonna ask about her being fired? Is, that, is it a, I'm sorry you're fired omelet? Oh. This is what happened in the first episode, so. Is this kind of like a reboot of sorts, I guess? Oh geez, awkward. <laughs> you could use it for your what? He left the omelet and ran away in pain. B, your house is so cute. Do you guys see all the stars hanging from her ceiling? I wanna live there. I love it. I wanna hang out with Bee and Puppy Cat and eat yummy omelets in their cute apartment. Oh my gosh, poor Deckard, I'm so sorry, dude. Even his house 
this is cute. What's on the trees? Are those like oranges with bows on them? You know what? The style of this show reminds me a little bit of Animal Crossing. Do you guys know what I mean? Like even the music and like the style of the town, like that just walking up to his house looks like a freaking Animal Crossing house. I was expecting an animal to come out. Maybe that's why I love it so much. Girl, you were in wrestling school? That's awesome. <laughs> oh, that was so nice of you to bring her dinner. Why did she call her a little old girl lady? I haven't seen the first season like in a while, like the first episode, but I feel like this is what happened in the first episode, right? It was a long time ago that I first reacted to it. It was like a year ago. I guess his sister is not the biggest fan of me. What? Hmm. Right, I feel like I remember this guys. In like the first episode, he like gives up on baking or something. I vaguely remember. What are all these rainbow puppy cats spinning around? Ooh, trippy. This is so relaxing. So relaxing. Whoa, what is this creature? Is it a creature? This is beautiful. Like seriously, give me lo-fi music like this, twinkly music and pastel aesthetics any day and I am like on board. I just want to sit here and just like watch this and like be in this world. Little puppy cats are in her hair. Guys, I had to react to this on my channel. It's like my vibe. That was a weird dream, girl. That was a weird dream. How much melatonin did you take? Melatonin gives me very weird dreams, guys. You're late. Oh no. What is she late to? B, get your life together. Oh no, B, girl. Is she applying to work at a turtle store? What is that? Is it literally just a turtle store? All right, turtle store. <laughs> it's Puppy Cat chasing ladybugs. You got it. Oh, so many toys for Puppy Cat. I love it. Puppy Cat deserves all the toys. Puppy Cat's voice is so weird. <laughs> it's pronounced snurt. <laughs> Girl, you do need to eat. Your stomach is growling so loud. So she understands the, she understands puppy cat language? <laughs> what is a pet? Mm. That's true. Yeah, they can. My hamster sleeps all day. <laughs> that was a very good explanation of what it's like living with a pet. <laughs> <laughs> I would use money if I had a job. Is Puppy Cat gonna get her a job? What's that invitation? What is that invitation? Temp space. <laughs> Little paw. That's Puppy Cat's signature. Just take your little paw. Boop. If I'm a pet, you have to learn how to get money. I mean, solid point. There's a computer. There she is. She still looks the same. <laughs> Unrecognized intruder. She's so cute. Oh my gosh. Jeez. It's a little scary. So now she has a job, doesn't she? Helping Puppy Cat. Be take any job you can get, girl. <laughs> Do I get paid for watching it, girl? I feel you. Okay. So what kind of jobs are these? Just fixing my purse. 
It's actually really fun to play with this, guys. I'm like addicted to it now. Okay. Yay, changing costumes, obsessed. There's fashion involved too, guys, I can't. I'm obsessed with this. I'm so excited to watch this whole thing. <laughs> uh, that was a little creepy. So, temp space agents. Interesting, interesting. Can we get an easy baby assignment? Oh, a literal baby? I meant to drop for a baby. Puppy cat, you're so funny. <laughs> oh, she looks so cute. Ah, look at her. Wait, she looks adorable. Oh my gosh, I love it. Love your hair like that, B. That's because you already look like a baby. Puppy cat, yeah, the joke is always about puppy cat being like a baby and puppy cat's always like, I'm not a baby. <laughs> so funny. They look so cute. Uh, I love B's outfit. I want it. She looks so adorable. She looks like a little space, a little space girl. Oh my god, it's literally a baby planet! Oh, but the baby's so sad. I know this baby, but there were more parts to it last time? Okay. <laughs> I like minimalistic babies. So it's just a head with a body bubble now. Where's its body? Poopy cat. <laughs> it's puppy cat. Hmm. So is this gonna be a thing where they like go on missions to like help people with like their emotional problems? Kind of similar to like Steven Universe. Cause I'm okay with that. Who's this baby's mama? Yeah, maybe don't give the baby gum. <laughs> Ooh, mean baby, super rude. She's almost as messy as you are, I mean. <laughs> oh no! Puppy cat's not ugly. Puppy cat smile. <laughs> Man, I hate that baby. Oh, once upon a time there was a space outlaw who fell in love with the space king's daughter. Oh! And they both knew they were meant to be together. So the princess agreed to run away. And they planned to meet at their favorite meadow. Is this story gonna come back later? I hope so. But it was a trap. The princess lied. The outlaw was surrounded by the king's army, filled with anger from betrayal. The magic was meant to capture the outlaw. Oh no, that's pretty messed up to do but instead transformed him into a monster. Oh, wow. How mysterious. That's a little bit of a heavy, complicated story to tell a baby, but okay. That has to be foreshadowing. Um, not what I was expecting to happen. Definitely not what I was expecting to happen. All right, where did this, Oh, who is this? Oh my goodness, who is this? Okay, not the dark turn I was expecting. Oof. Okay, that's terrifying. Oof, oh. Wait, puppy cat, I'm a big, wait, puppy cat was the prince? Was Puppy Cat really a prince? I'm so confused. Wait, that's gonna be insane if that's true. Oh no. Be your bell. Does she have a magical girl bell? Come on. Of course she does. What? Um, that's an awesome sword. Yes, go be! Jeez! I can't let you just bit her like that. I agree, puppy cat. That's pretty sick. Brave, though, but, like, dangerous. Oh, jeez. I was... Wow. Okay. Mm 
<laughs> like a baby. Oh, puppy cat. Oh, oh, she's turning puppy cat into a laser. Wow. That was crazy. I'm not the only one after you. Interesting. So is Puppy Cat really not what they seem? I'm wondering. I mean, I think that's they they literally showed Puppy Cat briefly transform into the prince for two seconds. So that's really interesting. I wonder if Puppy Cat inside really is a prince, like a space prince, who was transformed into Puppy Cat. That'd be super cool lore, I have to say. I kind of hope it's true. Uh, but now Puppy Cat needs a nap because that was a pretty big space adventure. <laughs> I'm loving this so far. I really do hope it gets some like deep lore though and it's not just like episodic, but we'll see. I love how Bee literally has a bee on her sweater. Oh, Deckard wants to hang out with her. Sorry guys, just want to reapply my lip balm. Oh, their kitchen is so magical. How come everyone's like design style is on point in this show? I wanna live in this town. Look at their kitchen. Those curtains are amazing with the moons and stars on them. Cute octopi. <laughs> Octopuses. Oh, <laughs> he's so cute. It'd be cute if like the plural word for octopus was octopi though. I agree. Puppy cat's still catching up on some sleep. Oh, is this a flashback? That's baby B. Don't put a fork next to that girl. That's dangerous. What is this? <laughs> oh. Hmm. Glitch Gorge. What is this? Is that B? Cause she has like purple hair. What is happening? Is this a flashback? Like, oh, we got her ice cream. Who's that little boy crying? She's playing in the water. Oh, he was babysitting her? Who was that guy? That can't be B though, cause she's so young. Is this like, is B is secretly magical? That's definitely her dad. Hmm. What? Whoa, he just like whammed into that bird. Oh, it's definitely B, it looks just like her. Does that mean she's from like another world or something? Or is it just, maybe it was just a dream he was having? So mysterious. T wow, really? They had to make Puppy Cat fart like that? Even the ending credits are cute! Eee! <laughs> Guys, I really loved it. I can't wait to keep watching. Um, I feel like they definitely are foreshadowing some lore, which I'm excited about. And I just love like the feel of the show. The characters are so cute. The music is so nice. It's just like a nice experience watching it. And it's like literally my exact aesthetics. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed watching with me. I can't wait to keep watching this show along with Amphibia. And I'll be back next time. I hope you guys have a great, great day. And I'll see you next time. Bye.